Well, welcome back here into the garden at Gardener's Cottage on the North Norfolk coast on another dry and sunny end of July day. We're really struggling this season keeping this garden going. We've had no rain here in Norfolk now for probably months, certainly three or four weeks. We've just had spits and spats. I'll show you the lawns in a minute. They're absolutely parched. Just look at this and I think most lawns in North Norfolk are looking very similar to this. We don't irrigate this. It's just bone dry. The grass has all shriveled back to brown and it takes some wear over the summer season as guests come with the kids and their dogs. Haven't had to cut this now. <coughs> here in the courtyard behind the cottage there's less of a feel of the drought that we've been experiencing most of the plants in here are really quite Mediterranean and able to cope with it the fig tree that was cut so hard back earlier in the season is just romping away just look at the new growth on this I'm sure it's going to end up by putting five or six feet of stem growth on each one of these I don't think this is going to fruit at all this year it doesn't usually do too well in this position but it's just grown for the effect and the shade that it gives in a really hot year, which is lovely. The wisterias having a second flush of flower. The may gold in the corner again on the new growth in this sunny season, putting on plenty of fresh bud and they'll continue to trickle flower throughout the summer. At the base, the only thing that is showing some signs of drought here is the lemon balm, which really is starting to recede into its rooting stock. I should think that probably would benefit from a good cut back. As we gave this rosemary just by the door that's completely overgrown itself, it can be quite brutal with rosemary and cut it hard back. It should shoot again from even woody growth pretty reliably. In the corner, the bay tree that's grown as a bush here. Again, Mediterranean plant, loving these drought conditions. Growing away, it's already had one full hard prune back to try and keep it in shape. It's rooting stocks under this gravel so it's absolutely ideal growing conditions for that. And all in all the courtyard's still looking lush and green whereas other areas in the garden are looking decidedly droughted this season. It's nice to have this area particularly in this warm weather we've been having 25-26 degrees and it's lovely sitting down here in the shade just being able to get a little breather from the sunshine. And if you've been out for the full day Enjoying the delights of North Norfolk. Thanks for watching.